I want to create a data warehouse that will be a genius in a subject. In order for him to be a genius, he need to go and through API, web services, data analysis, he need to go and grab the data, bring it into a lake. And then I want to take that data lake and I want to see that it knows how to, com how to first of all, compare each individual customer to itself, then to others in the same company, then between companies, then in a certain county, in a certain state, in a certain load of operation, in a different weather, and always monitor fuel consumption, not related to dispensation and not related to fuel delivery. And then I want to tell him, I want you to tell me when next I need fuel delivery. And because you, are, you have different APIs, I want you to see your best ability, faster lock the prices of how much I'm uh, uh, buying. And I want the AI to go and predict my next purchase because I monitor days before empty and the burn rates and my usage. And then you create another intelligent lake of fuel dispensation. And then I take Diego and I want to make his life easier when he go to purchase. But when he go to purchase, I want to know that I'm sending him to a station that he doesn't need to stand in line for 10 minutes, that he have royalty uh, programs when he go to certain station, that he prepaid for that, that, for that transaction that didn't happen before he even arrived to the station. And when he did the transaction, let's say Diego did 30 gallon transaction, what's the value of that to someone that delivering fuel if I'm accumulating all the 30 gallons, 20 gallons, five gallons, da, 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 yeah, in the city of Tampa, okay, in that service station, that's the production. I want to now go and monitor what will be my next fuel delivery. So you see how all of this tying together, yes? And you're running all of this with no human involvement, but with the ability to give the human best practice recommendation and best solution to deploy.